Hello everybody, this is me, Johan here. Now the upcoming OnePlus Z looks to be a really interesting smartphone. And there are many reasons why I feel you should consider it over the OnePlus 8. First and foremost, the display. Although this will be a lot cheaper than the OnePlus 8, OnePlus will not skimp in this department. It's a 6.4 inch AMOLED 1080p display. And the icing on the cake, it too will come with a 90Hz refresh rate screen. Next, the chip. Although not as powerful as the Snapdragon 865Us in the OnePlus 8, the Snapdragon 765Us in the OnePlus Z, as per Antutu, scores over 300,000 points, which is almost on par with the powerful Snapdragon 845. Performance-wise, again, there will be no compromise. It will be a fast and snappy phone. It is also tipped to come with up to 8 GB of RAM and 128 GB of storage. Next, it is 5G enabled. Just like the OnePlus 8, the OnePlus Z2 will be a 5G enabled smartphone. 5G won't be a reality in India for a few more years. But for countries with 5G, it will be a future-proof device. Next, the battery. The OnePlus 8 has great battery life with its 4300 milliampere battery. The OnePlus Z will come with a 4000 milliampere battery and with its more power efficient chip it will deliver on par or even better battery life than the OnePlus 8. Next the legendary OnePlus update cycle. It will be updated as long as the OnePlus 8 with at least two major software updates and three years of security patches. Next, the charging speed. OnePlus again will not skim the fast charging of the 8 series. The Z2 will come with a 30 watt fast charger. Finally, the most important part of it all, the pricing. It should be priced anywhere between $400 to $500. And in India, with their aggressive pricing, OnePlus should launch the phone at a starting price of Rs. 30,000 or maybe even more aggressive and price it below 30 k Given the situation of the OnePlus 8's pricing, a difference of over 10,000 is quite huge and quite honestly for most users who just want a fast and reliable phone and not someone who games constantly. For a budget conscious consumer, the OnePlus Z is the phone to buy over the OnePlus 8. So that's it for me today guys. I hope you guys liked the video. If you guys loved the video, I'd appreciate it if you guys could give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And do hit the bell icon so that you all get notified with the latest and greatest videos. The second they are uploaded on YouTube by me. So what else can I say? Wishing all of you a tremendous day ahead of you. Ciao for now.